all right i'm on chapter 93 right now because chapter 92 wasn't nothing but chapter 90 like it was a reiteration of chapter 90 man so i'm on chapter 93 right now so let's do this All right, so the cover page is Metal Bat and his sister with, it looks like Saitama with an afro. And he got a karate gi on in the back, right there. That's the cover page, man. That shit was sick. Metal Bat's cool, man. I like the dude. I, did, I know this going to be, since the cover page was that, and this is a 14 um, chapter page, so not even that big at all. For a monthly, I don't know what other stuff Yusuke does, but... If he doesn't do anything else for a monthly freaking uh, manga that comes out once a month, for him to put out 14 pages is like, come on, man, that's some bullshit, man. Like, come on now. Come on now. You can put out more pages than that now. Come on. Like, don't do me like this. All right, so let's get into this, man. It's dangerous here, Zinko. How did you know that I was here? You said that you were at Mouse Sushi on the phone, so I came near the store. Then Monster showed up. Now I'm not about screaming, ah, I don't have time to talk to you. Yeah, he, for he forgot about the giant centipede. I just remembered that, that the father and his son are in danger. If you don't, if I don't, if I don't hurry. <laughs> Now Pineapple and that other dude had got, had took the father and the son before Metal Bat had started fighting Garo. Like that's what happened. Now he's like, huh? You're kidding, right? His, his sister talking. You're severely wounded. And then Metal Bat, I think Metal Bat's walking away because she's like, wait, you better stop or you will die. Let's go shopping. What? Get out of here. Don't she know that he gotta save everybody? Zenko, go home first. Why? Because I have, because I can't also take care of you at the same time. Then she jumped and was like, "Dorn, you're too stubborn." She slapped him on the back of, she slapped him on the back of the head. And he had failed. What the hell? <laughs> he just fell. What is that? Like, he just fell down and stuff. And she's like, Oni-chan. He's like, Domo. Oh, he seems to have lost consciousness. And this is the bird and the freaking, uh, the bird is talking. He's on the peacock thing. Whatever it is. It'd be easy to choke the life out of him now. He sludged jelly. What? Hey, sludge jelly. No, hey, sludge de jellyfish. Oh. Man. Forgive me for my messed up reading, man. But it's like, they got, it's not very, like, cohesive in the way they word the words. If you know what I mean. <clears throat> then he looked beside him and that freaking piece of thing is gone. Like, well, <clears throat> where did he vanish to now? And he's like, the dude is walking. Uh, he's coming out of, like, a drain pipe on the street and stuff. He's like, he's laughing, he he, Metal Bat's little sister. However many hostages we have, it can never be too much. Yes, it can, at some point. And somebody was like, hey! Said, coming out of the drain pipe right up there. And stuff, talk to him. Somebody was like, oh, snap! Goro! Just destroyed the dude! Why did he do that? Whoa, why do you do that, man? Oh, snap. I hope Garo ain't like Goku to where he won't fight you unless you at your full strength and he at his full strength because it's dumb. That's how Goku lost to Superman. If you know about the Death Battle thing, now, don't get me started on that shit. I already did a freaking video about that. Go check it out on my channel, man. But Gar just destroyed him. Look at that. Gar came in and just destroyed the dude. 
And it's like, you're the one who's been watching me with these disgusting eyes, right? I hate being observed. Excuse me. Uh, gay Bobo. Gee Bobo. He's like calling out for somebody's name or something. It's squashed in. Like, oh, he's still alive. <clears throat> Is Gar about to fight these freaking things? Or what's going on? Wait here, Hunter. And that's the peacock with the thing. He came down, landed right beside him. And Gar's like, two on one, huh? And now, uh, he's like, we're not your enemy. I think this might interest you. And then he hands him a card with like some evil looking face on it. It looks like it need to be on a pumpkin or something like that down there. He hands him a card and stuff and then that's all that. All right. My like monster association. Oh, he ripped up that car. <laughs> like monster association. As expected, he got interested in it. Follow me. We'll guide you to your base. To our base. He ripped up the car. He's like, not interested. Get lost. <laughs> Whoa, car ain't no joke, man. I ain't no joke. I used to let the mic smoke. That's all I know about that song, man. I need to listen to it so I can know more words. And now the piece of guy is like, this bastard. He tore up the invitation card. Now the peacock thing is like, foo foo foo. He's like, laughing or something. And I saw a video with um, Tekken. Well, I watched Tekken 101 and stuff. And he was, he, he was reading a Bleach chapter and stuff. And they had the same laughing in the Bleach chapter, that foo foo foo. I thought it was hilarious, man. And he was like, why in the world all these anime characters got weird laughter? Like that dude who had, that giant guy who had rescued Robin when she was on um, Ohara. <clears throat> and he laughed, there, there, G, 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 G. That's how I had me laughing, man. It was so funny, dog. He is absolutely right, man. These anime characters be having some weird freaking laughs, man. But that's why we love them, though. Because that makes them unique in their own, in their own sense, in their own right. Now freaking birds guys like I'll overlook what you did now. But in the near future, we definitely will see you again. If you continue you continue being a hero hunter. And he's flying away. Just he left his boy on the ground. He just flew away. Like he was like, look, I ain't messing with that. Once once he saw what Garo did to that piece of dude, he was like, look, I ain't messing with him. You can have him. Now, now he, um, he's like, I won't forget what you did to me. The piece of guy is going back in the um, sewage pipe or whatever. The drain system. And Gara walked around the corner and stuff. And he's looking, he's like being introspective right now. Just looking down. And, uh, it's very comic book style in that, that uh, panel right there. It's like disgusting. I'll show it to y'all. Like the panel right there at the top is very comic book style. He looks like he's being introspective while uh, freaking <clears throat> while walking away and stuff. It's crazy. All right, now freaking oh, they go pineapple and um and the other dude or oh, kiss. He must be like um kiss something. I forgot his name, but he looks like kiss and they're fighting some rhino guy. Yeah, I forgot about that because they had left because. Metal Bat had gave them that rich guy, excuse me. Ooh, man, I just ate some pizza. Um, I mean, some spaghetti. Burping, man, that don't digest it. So they they had had the rich guy and his son, and Metal Bat gave them, gave them to them to make them run away from what's happening because they're C class people. Like, they're not strong enough to fight no dragon level monster or Garo. Like, they're not strong enough. They would get demolished. So now they're fighting this rhino who looks like he's at least tiger. No. It's, no, he's at least demon. Yeah. Because it's, it's, uh, it's tiger, demon, dragon, and god. Those are the four. And there might be one underneath that. And it might be five. There might be one underneath that. I'm not sure. But he looks like he's demon, man. So let's get into this. What? Was that the limit of your powers? And I think, oh snap, so they were fighting him. Pineapple, uh, the kiss guy. And my odd attack didn't work on him at all. We hit him tens of times, he's he's like a rock. <clears throat> and that's those are the guys I'm talking about, Pineapple and the kiss looking guy. 
They fighting that rhino that's right there and stuff, man. I remember this young now. It's been so long, man. It's been a couple of months since I've seen them. So, yeah. All right, so now the freaking rhino dude looks like he's either hurt or, or what is he doing? Laugh, laughing? I don't know what he's doing. He yelled out, fun. I will now proceed to rate your ultimate attacks one by one. Pineapple Grenade, that's his name. Three points. Uh, connected, no, Concentrated Pine Strong Acid Juice, one point. Apple Pine Cannon, seven points. I don't know what he's doing. He's a Mohi Cutter. <clears throat> Mohi Cutter, two points. Mohi Punch, zero points. Also, Pineapple actually is stronger than um, Mohi. I'm thinking that's what his name is. <clears throat> Alright, find your information. All of these were scored out of 100 points. Whoa! This is the, this is the time. No. This is the level of an average pro hero. How weak you all are. This has to be a joke. And that's it. And it's supposed to be some more freaking uh, stuff out there because it's like, that's the end of the chapter, man. January 1st, we in February, man. Where that other chapter? I got to know. Dang, man. I got to know you need. And if y'all know how I can freaking uh, find out about the real chapters that get put out by um, Yusuke and all the other people that's in Japan, like when they put them out, put it down in the descriptions and let me know. Because I really want to not find out and know the stuff, man. But that's the end of the chapter. That's all I got for this review, man. Thanks for watching. Tell me how I did on the review and tell me how the review was. <clears throat> if you like anything I had to say, leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, and all that, man. But I'm Dan the Awesome. You're awesome. Stay awesome. I love your faces. Peace. And I'll see y'all in the next one. One love. I'm out.